shoot six free throws there. So that kind of got us going, and thought we did a good job of closing out the game defensively, and uh, we just kept our composure, and uh, it's just it's a great win for us. Yeah, they went on a run there uh, in the second half, and I think we just kind of had to pull together and get back to doing what, uh, what we've been successful with, running the ball and, and being aggressive. But, you know, it, we, we took their best shot today, and they're a very good team. Doug, what were they doing against you defensively? Um, <coughs> um, I mean, they would double some, but sometimes they leave me one-on-one. Um, Ubel is a really good defender, really strong. He's about 6'10", so it's kind of hard to score over him. Um, but, I mean, I think I got going when I got to get to the line there a little. Got my confidence up, and uh, I mean they're a really good defensive team. I don't think we'll play a much better defensive team than that, so it's a it's a great way. Their emphasis on taking away the three pointer. How did that change what you guys wanted to do today? Um, well, like Coach said in the locker room, now every team's gonna try to take away something different from from us, and tonight that was kind of their emphasis. So uh, we just had to change our game plan up a little. Uh, work to work to get the ball inside and really really execute on possessions and then take two shots. Grant, Doug just said you guys played this will be one of those defensive oriented teams you play all year. It's different than the previous six games. Getting a win like this against a team like Nebraska defensively, what's that do for the confidence you guys going for? Um, you know, I think it helps a lot playing against different styles and you know, like Doug said, they're really good defensively and I thought for a lot of the game they we played at their pace. They controlled the pace with, with what they did defensively. <coughs> um, you know, we're gonna play a lot of, uh, against a lot of different styles and people that, you know, are gonna defend us differently and, and we gotta find ways to win and we did today. Hey Doug, can you just talk about the atmosphere out there? How much did that give you left of the day? Oh, uh, that's a lot of stuff. That heard the Century Link Center, I guess. Uh, it's a great atmosphere, a lot of Husker fans, but the uh, uh, majority were Blue Jay fans and uh, felt really good uh, to give them a little run there. And uh, they kind of they had our backs. And I uh, want to thank all the fans for coming out. It was a great atmosphere. Oh, yeah, it was, you know, it was packed in there today. And I know when they went on their little run and you heard the Husker chant, they got us a little fired up. Um, so then we got, we got our fans behind us too. but. You know, when the, when the Century League's rocking like that, it, it's a it's an incredible advantage for us. How much of an incredible advantage it is to have this guy on your team? <laughs> it makes life pretty easy, man. I'll, I'll tell you that. Um, you know, he's just got such a feel for the game down on the block. And, you know, every game it, it amazes me because when you play with him, you don't realize the kind of production he has, you know. You know, there was probably a time during the game there I thought he was struggling. Like, he wasn't getting touches, he wasn't scoring. and. 24 and 12, so there you go. Look that, Doug. What, yeah. What's this guy doing? I think the same goes for Grant. I think I've said it after every game. He's the biggest difference of our team this year. He, uh, he keeps us together. Um, when things are not going well, he's always constantly telling us in the huddle to get us to get, get it together. And uh, he's just been a great leader for us. Um, and he, and he just puts up numbers and he gets three assists, uh, six rebounds. He just continues to. Bring a lot of versatility to our team and a great leader, and it was a lot of fun to play with. You guys want me to leave? Thanks, man. <laughs> Grant, did you change any? Did your mentality change at all when you guys got behind? Um, I, I don't know. Not really me personally, um, but I think as a team it had to. I think we had to show a little more urgency, especially on the defensive end. And <coughs> tried to pull the guys together and tell them how critical of a moment that was, and for us to get back. <coughs> Back on track for what we're doing. And we've been preaching, you know, defense all week. There's going to be games we have to win with our defense, and I thought our effort was really good tonight. Grant, you played 39 minutes tonight. You had battled through a lot of injuries, a lot of adversity in your career to be able to be able to go for 39 minutes. What's that like for you? It's just pretty good. It was pretty good. I didn't realize that until you said that, but you know, obviously, I'm back in a position where I can play that many minutes, and I feel great. So only practice twice a week. So. <laughs> <laughs> Take two more questions for the student athletes. Doug, just talk about being undefeated here. Uh, what this week meant, San Diego State and the Nebraska win? Uh, I thought it was great for us because we were uh, in situations where we were behind, uh, and we were really behind at San Diego State. So it showed a lot of our team uh, how how much uh, further we've grown since last year. Just being able to keep our composure and great atmospheres and. Two good wins. I think uh, San Diego State's going to be a really good team this year in the Mountain West. I think Nebraska did very well, knocked off some 
really good teams this year. I think Bo Spencer uh, is a great addition to them, and they should have a really good season. Yeah, I mean, two good teams that we beat, and uh, one of them on the road. So just got to continue to get better uh, moving forward. And, you know, I was really impressed with Nebraska. I thought they were the best team we've played so far. And um, they played really well. Like I said, they controlled the pace, and, and uh, it was a big win for us. <coughs> Last question. <coughs> Anything else? Thanks, gentlemen.